there's a question here about uh, nightmares, and, and it, the question is, do nightmares cause the body to release adrenaline, making it difficult to return to sleep if the nightmare wakens you up? Okay, one of the things that's really interesting about nightmares is they occur, of course, during dreaming sleep, and the technical term for that is REM sleep, rapid eye movement sleep. Now, if we were to take someone in REM sleep and put them into a brain scanner, what we would see is that they're their brain is hy hyper metabolized, is what we call it. In other words, there's a lot of oxygen, there's a lot of glucose going in there. It's, there's a time of great activity, if you like. And of course, um, we get fragments of um, that in our awareness of, of, of dreams. You know, we sometimes waking up where we've been dreaming. It's a little window into the fact that our mind and our brain is actually very, very active. A nightmare, of course, is a particularly scary type of dream. And of course, it's associated with fight and fight type responses and the release of adrenaline. And absolutely, if you're waking up of a nightmare, um, you'll be relieved at first to think, oh gosh, it wasn't real, and you'll come down from that high arousal level that you were at during your dream. But also you'll recover fairly quickly, but it might take you a bit longer to fall back to sleep. And that's because the fight and flight responses have been activated um, at a time when we weren't conscious to deal with them, and that is naturally quite a threatening thing um, for us uh, to deal with. So what's really important about this question is to recognise that during sleep, the brain is highly active and that dreaming and indeed nightmares are just a window into what's going on inside our brains at that time because they keep processing information. And during our dreams, the other parts of our body are relatively relaxed. Our muscles are very relaxed so that we don't act out our dreams. So thanks for that question, really interesting one.